Hey everyone! Today we are going to be talking about the things that are going in my kids' stockings. So if you didn't see, um, last week I did a what my kids are getting for Christmas video and this week we're gonna do their stockings. And um, I like to fill their stockings pretty full um, with things that are inexpensive, not a ton of candy, although I... I do have a little bit and um, things that they're going to use rather than just being Christmas garbage. You'll have to excuse my voice today. I'm getting over a nasty, nasty cold and I'm going to be honest. I don't know if I'm done, but I'm doing this video anyways to show you what I have so far. Also, while we're at it, I did forget to put something in my last video this my four-year-old is getting this guy he is the design and drill bolt and bucket power it has a working power drill and it has these little guys on top but it's got these little guys on top a bunch of screws and he can just drill into this so woo. so let's get started on their stockings should we start with the candy like I said, I don't like to put a whole lot of candy in there because I just feel like it never gets eaten. Um, so I kind of just only put things that I really think my kids are going to eat inside of their, um, inside of their stockings. We're going to start off with these little guys, these little push pops. And then I found this. Oh, it's upside down. Um, the bubble tape, my, um, three oldest kids will get a bubble tape, and since he's too young for bubble gum, my baby will get this guy. And then they're each going to get a box of um, just candy that they like. Um, so my oldest son is getting Sour Patch Kids. He loves these. My daughter is getting the red-flavored Starbursts. My four-year-old is obsessed with peanut butter. He will eat anything peanut butter. So I got him the Reese's Pieces. And then for my little guy, he likes Skittles. He can chew them well, so we went with Skittles. And then I thought I was done buying candy until I went to Walmart and saw these. They're so cute. These are $1 at Walmart. It comes with two of those little truffles. And my kids love these truffles. So they're each getting one of these cute little mini personal bags. And then everybody's getting a box of crayons because my kids have lost or broken so many crayons. So I just got everybody their own box. And then my kids really love like these little surprise toys. My baby is getting the Coco Melon one, mostly because he was there when I bought it and he begged for it. They didn't have a really, um, a really good one for my four year old. Not one that I thought that yes, he needs that one. So I'm with Stitch, I think that you'll like that inside. He likes Lilo and Stitch, um, but yeah. For my daughter, we got this Barbie Pets one. She loves Barbies, so she's gonna think this is really cool. And then for my eight-year-old, Among Us, he is constantly, he loves this game. So he, I don't know what's in here, but he's gonna like it, I'm sure. Okay, and then we went with some bath bombs. My kids have been really into baths lately. Um, even though two of them typically take a shower, but, um, and my little two still take a bath, but they like to relax and unwind, my older two like to relax and unwind with a bath sometimes. So I went ahead and got each of them a bath bomb. So this is my daughter's. It's supposed to turn the water rainbow. This one is my oldest son's. It is the Jurassic Park Dino Egg. And then we have Baby Shark for my four-year-old and... Coco Melon for my two-year-old. Like I said, they really like taking baths, so they're each getting one of these little pens. They like these things. Um, I don't let them have them often because I don't like to clean it up off of my tub, but it's Christmas. And then I got them each um, some Play-Doh. Um, Play-Doh is just one of those things that goes bad really quickly, and all of my kids still really just love to play with it, even if it's just to squish when they're frustrated. So each of them is getting two little things of Play-Doh. 
So I like to get my kids these little poofs for stuff like this. Um, mostly just because I feel like it's a good time to replace them because I like to put, I like to replace mine a couple times a year. This one is for my two year old. It is goofy. Then for my four year old, he's obsessed with superheroes. So he's getting Captain America. My daughter is getting Encanto. And then my Star Wars obsessed eight year old will get the Mandalorian. And then I like to put at least one thing in there that they have asked for throughout the year. So my oldest son, he has a locker at school. They just have lockers that they can put their backpacks in. Um, and not, not a lot of them put locks on it, but his one friend has a lock on his. And so he is, he needs a lock now. My daughter loves stuffed animals and this is so soft, you guys. She is so freaking soft and she's adorable. Um, so I think she's going to really like her. My four-year-old has one of these at preschool. Well, he doesn't have one. His teacher has one at preschool and he is obsessed with it. So I figured since he'll be leaving preschool in just a couple of months, um, we get him his own so that he can play with it at home as well. And then my baby, when we were walking through the Walmart to find some of this stuff, demanded he have this bath toy so I bought it for him in secret to give it to him in his stocking. So yeah that's what my kids are getting for Christmas. I'll probably pick up a couple things here and there along the way um, probably right up till Christmas to be honest um, to put in their stockings but um, for the most part that's what they're getting. I'd love to know what your kids are getting for Christmas and in their stockings so let me know in the comments and if you like videos like this one or um, mostly things that are just mom related um, subscribe and follow along because I'm gonna put out a video every Thursday. Thank you so much for tuning in and have a wonderful day. Bye!